if you're uh, a main player user well you ever came across uh, a challenge where you need where you need to install some applications and uh, these applications require you to have a 64-bit image i made a video about the same issue previously and guys were asking me how they can download and implement this image into their system without any hassle so in this video that's what i'm going to show you each and everything so this is my system which is being loaded over here and uh, I'm going to show you how you can get the 64-bit image to your PC so that uh, you keep it running 24-7 just like the way you're seeing this one over here. So. Uh, my name is Scott from scottug.com and in this video I'm going to show you how you can install your own how you can install a 64-bit image into your main player and uh, the thing is that I'm going to show you from scratch so if you're new to this channel don't forget to subscribe to this channel by clicking the subscription button as well if you you can click you can comment as well you can share this video so that you can read through and uh, you can go to scottug.com and you read more about what I'm going to make in this video so let's do this First, I'm going to use a server here just to make it to make things easier. So I've run into my system, and uh, the first thing you wanna do is to launch this Mount Instance Launcher. And after that, the other thing you wanna do is uh, when you when you look at this, I'm having Android seven, and uh, it's not sixty four bit. But uh, if I look, check over here, you'll see that uh, you have this option over downloading sixty four bit image. Okay. Now, what I'll need to do is to just select Android 7 64 bit and uh, it will start downloading. Okay, so me, I'm using a server, that's why the system is downloading it very, very, very quick. Actually, it is on 99%. So that's at which my computer runs. But if I told you you're using your own PC, the system might differ from uh, what the speed might differ from what you're seeing over on my screen there. So um, so at times people say the system stacks at 99% but uh, at times it's just been downloading more and more other support files so that they can go through so what you need to do is to just give it time and uh, you'll be set to go so the good thing is that I'm going to leave the download link of this image in the description of this video and what you need to do is to just click there and boom it will be ready for you to use so as you can see on our screen over here um, we've downloaded our image and uh, and uh, by the time I'm recording this video since I'm using a server this image might not be supported onto my server and what I'm going to do is to just export this image for you guys to download because uh, lots of the comments out there people don't see this option of uh, friends don't see this option of uh, where they have uh, the 64 bit but uh, they'll need to download this is due to some network issues when you're offline and many other things so i've solved this by i'm going to export this image for you guys so all we need to do is to just click on the link i'll leave in the description of this video and you download this image and you import it so i'm going to show you each and everything from exporting to importing so what i'm going to do next is to show you how you can import this image first let me show you how to export so i've canceled this the issue is simple you just go over here at the options where you see and then you click export and then you click okay then i'm going to save it over my desktop because i'll need to use it okay i'm going to name it mem uh, 64 bit okay the extension is over okay 64 bit image and uh, 64 bit image okay okay by scott gg so after that i will click save and uh, it will export so my system you like get me where well, like my system has a higher it's serving higher specs so the, the rate at which things operate might differ because i uh, usually read, read comments uh from my friend saying that uh, why does it keep taking take long so you need to have a stable internet connection and uh, the good thing that you're going to download this image you would be you won't need a stable internet connection so all you need to do is just 
download and after downloading you need to import so if you're new to this channel don't forget to subscribe and uh, um if you're if you're new to this channel don't forget to subscribe and like as well um don't forget to visit our website that is coachug.com for more amazing tips there are some stuff we don't post over here and uh like in terms of sports and many other things but uh if you go to scottyg.com you can get the detailed info about what all what we discuss over here okay our export is about to get finished and uh, i'm going to show you um, after the export i'm going to delete this image and i'll show you how to import uh the 64-bit image of name into name player so this video is mostly for those gamers uh the people who use gaming pcs like those who need to know how to import a 64-bit and uh as well um i'll be making more videos or, or about name and gaming so feel free to subscribe to this channel because well i'm bringing more and more